yeah, the creative process for me, it starts with an idea. Um, usually it's a word or a thought that emerges sometimes in my journaling, sometimes from a dream, sometimes from an event that's happened. And then it, it won't let me be. I have to write about it and it just nags me until I sit down and write. Sometimes it'll be on a piece of scrap paper. I usually carry a little notebook where I write notes because of that. And then later it gets developed. It has probably three phases. One is that initial spurt, the initial uh, desire, the ganas to write it down. Then there's the dra first draft, the writing, and then the revision. I take a long time to revise because that's just the process I follow. Not everybody has the same process. And it's been with me since probably nine years of age. It's always been there that I want to write and create. I'm not a visual artist. I don't use that, but I am very visual in the descriptions and I use images like photographs. So there's this kind of blending in how I create using images or, or visuals and words. I also have a collection of poetry that I work with a visual artist to create. It's called Transcendental Train Yards. And so the images and the poetry are on the same um, print, they're prints. So I think I always kind of combine the two in my own creative process.